There's quite a bit of household stuff out of the Leeward Estate. Uh, some electronics, a you know, big box full of Legos, office supplies, glassware, neat big clock, the Hamilton Beach mixer, Rydell wine glasses, some uh, decent uh, cookware, it's like Kelflon maybe. Some other neat odds and ends, older stuff. Everything here is for the uh, point out gumball machine except for the glass part. Boxes of jewelry. Some real good textiles in this auction. Some neat stuff. Some quilts. This is a cool roll shirt with hygienic label. Beautiful colors in this quilt. And in this one. It's like almost a Dresden plate. Beautiful beaver state. Indian trade camp blanket. Neat little Vietnam box here. Photo album full of pics from there and afterwards. Four uh, maps and they're all laminated. Uh, Hereford, Hereford, uh, what is this? American Hereford journals. Joseph originals. A couple of nice glasses of glasses of boxes. Boxes of glasses. Just all odds and ends. But they're good old ones and we'll sell them by the box. A little Korean rice, nice little red teapot. Teapots are hard to find and two casseroles. Madame Alexander's on two shelves here. This is cool, that piece on the left is a lamp. Lights up. Meet Stanley Level. It's a Ducks Unlimited artist. There's a duck, duck pictures there, some old uh, fossil bones. Dig the mixer, that's pretty cool. Dormeyer. More old photos. Bunch of pictures in the rack. You know, we'll sell choice rack, choice shelf. Well, we will sell the collection of Boston's as a collection. Uh, I think a th about a third of them are in good condition. Uh, we'll sell them as one lot. Love the uh, red glass wheel with the golf ball stand. Nice big glass to camp on uh, terrain. Schumann, I think these are Havlin. No, Schumann, two sets of Schumann plates. Real beautifully gilded though. This is a wonderful Asian bowl. It looks like an older one to me as well. Nice stained glass window, some rods and then some decorative pieces. Little group of uh, Ainsley Pembroke. You know, have five good pieces there. This is super cool. A wool swimsuit with an embroidered female swimmer. Just super, super cool stuff. Again, from the Kansas City, Kansas Estate. Three nice old ink, ink stands or pen stands, fountain pens. The letters and numbers are metal. It's pretty cool. Framed up black cat good luck postcards are running in the groups. These look like they're Sterling bases, but there's no marks. This is Tiffany Sterling. That little piece there weighs an ounce by itself, and then you got the rest of it. Unfortunately, there's a big crack in the glass. This is a Sterling top. So nice, but this is a piece of Kristoff. What's this guy? A uh, German, nice German ball. Neat figure little piece there. These are nice Kansas City artists. Kansas City Art Institute professor. Salesman sample advertising set. Two layers there, make sure you look at both. It's loud. Nice gold group of hand fans. Some neat jewelry. Wheat pennies. That's cool, the big Kansas City, Missouri advertising uh, Easter egg. Brothel inspector. Everybody needs one of those. Cotton belt rock, little uh, pieces, really cool. Little cast iron knockers, hotel tags. Priest of Palace, with the four Priest of Palace postcards. Nice jewelry, some silver. That belt is cool, that's a silver buckle. Mosaics, some new watches, a couple more fountain pens. Some nice jewelry, beautiful 14 karat amethyst ring up front. These are Eisenberg, some pearls. Beautiful sterling enameled swordfish. And some gold, 
some nice deco. Neat little sterling and blue topaz bracelets, nice. Oh, those are <laughs> two pictures didn't turn around. Uh, nice gold earrings. Waterford, Val St. Lambert, Baccarat, Waterford, Waterford. The French clock is super cool. Uh, obviously that sits there and is glued on. The bird is just a loose piece. We just set it separate so that nobody hurt themselves or the piece or another piece. Beautiful engraving up here that I have a picture of the Rudolf Ackerman. One recently sold for $960, I think it was. Nice little 40s frames. These are super cool little bracket shells with the uh, iron cupids. Not really cupids, but nice little carved display shelf. Good glass. George Jensen, that's a cool piece of George Jensen. The stainless picture is pretty sweet. Nice paperweights. Love the little black cat collection. Beautiful little tea set here. A little Vienna beehive mark. You know, tray, pot, cream sugar, and two cups of saucers. Nice, I love the brown smoky, uh bronze vase is pretty cool. Advertising it was awesome. RS pressure vase. You know, I just don't see those, and it looks like it's good and right to me. I mean, it just looks like it's a good old thing. Really neat little odds and ends and pottery, some advertising pieces, little bronzes, Limoges. Cool mission art, mission clock. Waterford, Waterford, and Waterford. That's the nicest, biggest Waterford fixture we've had to sell down here in a long time. Hopefully we get that lit up by Tuesday. This vase here is Le Bret, French artist. Roseville, George Jones. It's like a Dalton Lambeth stoneware here. There's not really a mark on it. Czechoslovakian. Door stops, including Frank Art and Bradley and Hubbard. This is cool. World's Fair Chicago transfer plate. This is super cool. I'm thinking it's a string holder. Because there's a hole in the hat, and it's cast iron. Cast iron door stops. Little transferware pieces. This is cool, little uh, circus carnival target there. It's a pretty neat deal for 22. And the item of the auction. The Baker Chinoiserie Bouquet Secretary. Just over seven feet tall, so it'll fit in any house. Beautiful fitted interior. That's not the right key. Uh, I don't know what these keys are for. Slides. I know this must be really fun to watch right now. I don't know what you're seeing. <laughs> but check these out. The uh, rolled drawer fronts. The oak lining on them. Number 206. There's the Baker tag. Big as life. Special selections is the wine. You can still find it on their website. So there's a few chips here and there in the lacquer. But uh, one of the best, if not the best, pieces of furniture we've had to sell down here as far as a contemporary piece is concerned. Just extremely stunning. What a great presence. It will be phenomenal in your home, your shop, your collection. This truly is an heirloom quality piece of furniture decorated on all sides, on the top. Inside, you saw all the work done in there. Folks, we're really excited about this auction. Really excited about the upcoming move. It's uh, 
been a hell of a run here at the old place. But the new place is going to be pretty wonderful once we get all the get moved in. So we got a lot of work to do in a week or so. A lot of people are excited to consign at the new building. And we're excited to start selling down there. So come on down Tuesday night. Say goodbye to the old 11, 1106 Santa Fe address one more time. We'll probably have a couple of good fun things going on Tuesday night for that. And, uh, you know, plan on going home with some wonderful objects as well. What a great way to send out the old bird and get ready for the new place. Have a great holiday weekend, and we'll see you Tuesday.